These, these parents, you know, these kids are, are shouting out loud. They're getting, you know, they need, they need to express themselves. You know what I mean? And it's like the parents are like, shh, no, don't talk so loud. You, you know, and they're getting all embarrassed or whatever. You know, don't tell them to, to calm down. You know, don't talk so loud. I mean, these kids are already, they, they work differently. You know what I mean? They need to express themselves. You got to tell them to breathe. You know, focus on your breathing. I mean, that's what it's about. You got to teach them how to calm down. You can't just tell them to stifle. They're already having a problem stifling. You know what I mean? Man, it just it pisses me off. I mean, I know it's like these kids act differently. You know what I mean? Like you gotta you gotta find a way to connect with them. You know what I mean? You can't every all, all parents say the same thing. You know when their kids are acting up or whatever. Be you know be quiet. Don't 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 talk so loud. You know you gotta you gotta. You, no, no, you can't, that's, or that's rude, or whatever, whatever it is. I mean, these are not like everyday kids. You gotta, just, you know what I mean, just. And let me tell you, it works, okay? I saw this once, I saw this once, and the mother was like, just relax, remember what I told you, you know, just focus on your breath, focus on the sound of my voice, you know, just breathe. And you know what, that's true empowerment, okay, right there? Because when that, when that kid grows up, when, you, when mommy's not there, and when daddy's not there, and all the teachers are telling him what to do, what's he gonna do? He's gonna be acting out in different ways, but if you taught him how to control and relax, you know, relax and focus, I mean, that's what it's about, you know what I mean? So he can go off and, and, and be able to focus, you know? In and out and get back his composure, you know? And, and focus on what he needs to do. So breathe, you know what I mean? Breathing is, no, and you know what? The parents don't even breathe properly. This is the thing, I see people all the time shallow breathing, they have really bad posture, whatever, you know what I mean? And they, they, they're the ones who need to breathe first. They are the ones who need to calm down. And you know what? These kids are so sensitized. Their nervous system are all so sensitized that, you know, they pick up on that. Everybody's all agitated around them and, and they're not even breathing right. You know what I mean? You, you got to model that behavior first. So you know, these parents need to learn how to, you know, take proper breaths and breathe themselves. You know, that's all the shallow breathing, creating acidic waste in the body. It's causing the nervous system to, you know, overreact and become hypersensitive. It's not just these kids who have a hypersensitive nervous system. It's everybody else. That's why they flip out. They can't handle, you know, when a kid has these outbursts. You know what I mean? It rattles them. It rattles the parents. I mean, how are you ever going to calm, you know, and show your kid how to calm down and get centered? You know, breathe. If you don't know how to breathe yourself, it's like, it's ridiculous. I mean, then they, and then they wonder, you know, like, how come, I, how come my child's not learning? I don't understand. Well, that's because you're modeling the, you know, improper behavior anyways. Well, I just had to share that, you know what I mean? Just, I got to vent that out. Pisses me off.